Hey, what's up guys? We are here in Lucasfilm Studios or the Letterman Studios. This is where mostly the Lucasfilms are being made and this is the fountain dedicated to Yoda from the start. Let's go! I know you guys want to know more about Yoda and his location, but let's talk about the history first of the Letterman Digital Arts Center. Located inside San Francisco Presidio, a former U.S. Army base. The Art Center takes its name from its location on the former site of the Letterman Army Hospital, which was named for Dr. Jonathan Letterman, a medical director for the Army of the Potomac in the U.S. Civil War. When San Francisco hosted the Panama Pacific International Exposition of 1915, one of the temporary pavilions stood on this site. After the fair, all was removed except for the Palace of Fine Arts. The original hospital was built in 1898, and when the U.S. entered World War I, the East Hospital was built here, more than doubling Letterman's patient facilities. By 1918, this was the Army's second largest general hospital, caring for soldiers who were wounded in a trench warfare in France. During World War II, Due to its location on the west coast, the Letterman Hospital was the first stateside stop for soldiers returning from the far-flung Pacific Theater, including freed prisoners of war, 60 of whom were U.S. Army nurses captured in the Philippines. In 1945, the hospital received more than 73,000 patients from the Pacific Theater. The hospital also had an Italian service unit of 40 men to help out during the war. During the Vietnam War, the hospital received wounded American soldiers returning to the mainland, and the East Hospital was replaced with a new hospital to treat the growing number of war casualties. Over the years, the Letterman Hospital served both soldiers and their families with comprehensive health care and achieved renown for its medical intern programs. The Letterman Army Institute of Research opened behind the hospital in 1973. It conducted research on medicine, optics, nutrition, and toxicology. Rehabilitation The facilities closed in 1992, just before the Army left the Presidio and transferred the historic post to the National Park Service in 1994. The Hospital and Research Institute were replaced by Letterman Digital Arts Center, designed by Gensler Architectural Design and Planning and HKS Architects. The new buildings blend with the Presidio's architecture through their row-like arrangement, red and white color scheme, and glass and porches echoing historic post-architecture. Remnants of the hospital's history are literally embedded in the new facility, as 50% of the concrete from the hospital was used to create the new campus. Thus, the building was certified with gold LEED rating from the U.S. Green Building Council. The grounds, which include the garden and lagoon, were designed by landscape architect Lawrence Halprey. This income from this project, the largest new construction that took place at the Presidio. It helps maintain the more than 400 historic structures in the park and its forest and natural areas. Filmmaker George Lucas partnered with the Presidio Trust to bring about a 23-acre campus made up of four buildings and a 17-acre public landscape. Opened in June 25, 2005, the LDAC houses Lucasfilm, a digital film industry leader. The $350 million, 850,000 square foot center is home to 1,500 employees who began moving there in July 2005. Today, most visitors go to the LDAC to visit the wise figure of Yoda, immortalized as a life-size bronze fountain on the patio near the entrance to the Building B of the Letterman Digital Arts Center. Visitors can also step inside the lobby of Lucasfilm, which is open to the public during regular working hours. Inside, you can find props, memorabilia, and costumes from the Star Wars film series. Photography is allowed, so take your time and enjoy, but there are no tours or access to any space in the building beyond the lobby.
So that's it for the short history of the Letterman Digital Arts Center and Lucasfilm and Yoda Fountain. Until next time, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. Bye! So guys, if you like our videos, please subscribe to our channel and feel free to comment. Hit the bell, hit the bell, hit the bell, hit the bell, come on guys, hit the bell! For notifications. And don't forget to share. Hello! <laughs>